Hello, hello, and welcome back to Spyro the Dragon on PlayStation 1. A game that, though I have beaten it in the past, I have never actually completed it. So that is what we are going to set out to do uh, this time. Now, last episode, we did a couple levels, and there should be a couple more. So I think I can actually finish this Artisan's Homeworld right now. Or, well, get started on that right now, anyway. As I search for the next level that I have to play through. Uh, where was that town square? That was another level. Oh, or, uh, Stone Hill? No, I've, I've beaten Stone Hill already. I need to go this way. And yes, there's a dragon there, and town square was just up at the top of this tower. Up we go, Spyro! Now, what does Town Square have in store? We have 400 total treasure, though. That is worth noting. They did mention how many that there is at, well, at the end, once you have all of it. So I guess we still got a ways to go, but it is only the first world after all. These weird dragon chickens. This is funky music! You know, last time I brought up how I love the feel of the soundtrack to this game, and yet yeah, this is this is no different. Great stuff. I rescued Nils. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. Begin exploring by gliding to that area with the bulls. Use the L2 and R2 buttons to get a good look. Ah, thank you for pointing me in the right direction. I guess I can go no further this way, yeah. Like a lot of the levels in this game, this one is one giant circle that will eventually loop back around. No, I know what you're gonna do, and I don't want you to. You as well, get out of here. Break a few treasure chests, get a few more gems. And looks like we're climbing some more stairs. Oh, goody. Ah, oh, well, ah, these. These, these are weird ones. What you gotta do is hit them with something and then jump up and collect the treasure that pops out the top. Uh, can I, uh, oh, I can probably glide that way. Oh, this, this looks a little dangerous. Is there a, uh, can I, can I look down? Is there anything down there? Actually, it kind of looks like there, oh, no, 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 that is not sand, that is the wall. Okay, nothing there this time. Uh, last time I had to go on a bit of a wild goose chase looking for various gems, and eventually I did have to jump off a cliff. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, Spyro. I guess Spyro doesn't swim very well. Okay, uh, let's try that one again, shall we? Uh, oh, you're, you're, you're blocking the way, Mr. Bull. Get out of here. None of that. Uh, did that save the gems that I collected? Yes, it did. Good. Okay. So, uh, I've got to look before I leap. It would seem that not all cliffs contain gems at the bottom. Some of them, uh, contain water and drowning. Uh, who are you? Devlin! Thanks, Spyro. <laughs> I had the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Did you know that you get your longest glides by pressing X at the very top of your jump? Yes, uh, somebody already explained that to me, but thank you, though. Uh, useful information if I hadn't figured it out already. Uh, oh, little matador goblins. None of this. Whatever you two are doing, I don't approve. And I want the money that you're holding. Uh, anything else going on? Oh, water. Okay, uh, no water for Spyro. He doesn't like it. Now, I am pretty sure I can... I can glide around this way, right? Yeah, oh, maybe not. Okay, gotta, gotta get a little bit higher. There is another step I can take. There's a bunch of chickens. Okay, whoa, oh, and bulls everywhere. There are bulls and matadors. Just another day in Spyro World. Town 
ta uh, town square? Yeah, that's what they call it. Oof! Oh, I got bopped! I got bopped! No! Get out of here! Give me your money! You too! Thank you. And let's rescue Alvar. <laughs> Spyro, did you see a man dressed in blue running around here? He's a thief! And he's stolen a dragon egg! You've got to track him down and, and get that egg! Run! Run! <laughs> I'm getting a little winded! Okay, okay, settle down. Don't hurt yourself. Uh, I will rescue that dragon egg when I get around to it. Maybe there is one in every level. No, that, that can't be right. Can it? I is there a dragon egg in every level? I don't recall that being the case, but, well, maybe there is. Uh, there was... No, no, it can't be the case because I have beaten two levels and I only have one dragon egg. So I guess they're just scattered all over the place. But, yeah, now we can make it and collect the gems. Nice, nice. And there's... No, oh, there's probably nothing off the edge of this cliff, so I'm not gonna jump, but I do need to follow this thief and crash into the wall. Okay, money, 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 collect the money, uh, crash into more doors. It is difficult to run fast when you keep crashing into things. Uh, anything? I don't want to miss anything, no. All right, all right. Can hop across and charge through a couple more treasure chests. I wonder if there's... No, oh, there's got to be more than 150. Looks like this is another 200 gem level. Oh, this just loops all the way across at the uh, top of the level. Oh, did I... Did I miss those? I did. I looked around and made sure I didn't miss anything, and w would you... Hmm. Wouldn't you know it? I missed something anyway. Oh, where are you going? Huh. Okay. Well, looks like I've got to find my way back up there. Okay, we're back, and you are right here, so I can... Oh, oh I'm, I'm getting close. I'm getting close. I can get you. Yeah, there we are. Uh, that is dragon egg number two, I suppose. Okay, okay. Whoa, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, was this not? Yes, it is. Ah, get these treasure chests that were hiding just out of my sight. Okay, now we can continue adventuring in the heights of this level. What do we got, huh? What do we got? Uh, well, we can hop over this way, collect some more gems, break some more... Ooh, that was a 10! That was a big one. You, stop running amok. Give me your money. And, oh, these things are weird. You have to, like, yeah, you really have to heat them up, and then they break, and... 200? 200! There we go. And Thor, of course. Gotta rescue him. Thank you for releasing me! You know, I did not expect somebody named, uh, Thor the Dragon to sound like that, but uh, I guess that's Thor. Okay, is that everybody? Is that everything? No more dragons? Are we done? We are done! Where was the exit? I don't remember. Oh, is it... Is it over this way? Nope. All right. Well, looks like, uh, looks like I gotta figure out how to get out of this place now. See you in a second. Okay, it's gotta be just up here, right? Right? Maybe? Let's collect a chicken first. There we go. Is this the end? Yeah, this is the end. Okay. Okay. We got there. Returning home with another 200 treasure to add to our coffers. Up to 600. Now, uh, how, how many levels are there here? I don't actually remember. Are, are there only these ones? Was I completely wrong in thinking that there was one special level that was a little bit different than the others? Maybe the first one of those isn't until the second world. Uh, but there is a boss. I know that there's a boss somewhere. Ah, it's over here. Okay. I was looking for doors and there was no door. It was just another part of the overworld. And now we can fight Toasty, the first boss. What kind of fearsome foe will this be? Well, we're gonna find out right away. 
And we have landed. Okay, let's not run off the end of the world. And oh, there's a few enemies about. Okay. Uh, oh, oh, they have, they have dogs now. They're not just sheep. Okay, keep that in mind. They're dangerous. Uh, maybe they're wolves. Uh, hello? Yeah, get get out of here, please. Uh, oh, you you lived and fell back asleep. All right. Such is the way of things. Oh, I just have to hit them twice. They have two health. These, these are tougher enemies than most. But they give me money nonetheless, and that is always good. Uh, let's make sure that I actually have all of the money before moving on. Nice, there we go, 25. I imagine that's all of it, though I don't know for sure. Uh, more of these guys. No, no, no. You will stop that. Oh, I got squooshed. Quit it. No, no, no. Stop. Go away. Yes, the wolves, they do not bite, but they do pounce and squash you because they are so much larger than poor Spyro. Uh, what are you doing? Nothing. Just standing there, huh? Okay. If that is the way you do things, then who am I to argue? But I will take all of this treasure that you're guarding. So very, very poorly. Uh, here's a dragon. Hello, who are you? Nevin. Nasty Nork has put one of his most devious henchmen in charge of the artisan world. Bring him on. I think I smell a barbecue. Be careful, Spyro. This boss has many tricks up his sleeve. Many tricks, you say? Ah, oh, they're, uh, they're really hyping this one up, huh? I guess we'll just have to find out- oh, there you are. Uh, if, if you- if- just- just excuse me a moment, I- I believe there was one path that I didn't take, so let's just skip on over this way first. Pick up a few more gems, get- get squashed once more, okay, sure. Oh, and- uh, twice more, in fact. Oh, this actually doesn't bode very well for me now, does it? Uh, oh, I, uh, that, that's it! I'm done! Well. Truly, the wolves are the boss of this area. Not whatever that guy was. But now I'm curious, what's over here? Uh, mm, the, the camera does not make it easy for me. Come on, none of that. I don't need you to be stepping on me. There, go away. Well, that was death number two. Okay, I guess it wasn't even death number one. I did fall in the water once. Ah, well. Now then. As for the matter at hand, this boss, who is also guarded by wolves. Uh, let's, let's just, you know, roast him a little bit. Uh, yeah, run, run away, I guess. Take out more wolves, roast him again, and... All along, he was not but a sheep on stilts. Uh, even more of these pouncing wolves. Uh, oh, one of them got me. They are not easy to hit, actually. Uh, oh, uh, I guess that's that's the end of you, huh? Okay. Oh, did I miss gems? Did I miss gems? No, I didn't. They're right here. Uh, four of them are, anyway. Oh, dear. I missed something, didn't I? Oh, it's right there. Okay, crisis averted. Never mind. Hey, can I have your scythe? This thing's kind of cool. You know, maybe you would have been more effective as a boss if you'd actually used the darn thing. But who am I to judge? Uh, that is another hundred treasure, and we are officially done with the Artisan's World. World 1 is complete, and it is time to move on. We are all too familiar with the location of the, uh, balloonist. Did I say we were familiar with the location of the balloonist? I lied, because of course I have no idea where anything is. But Marco, the balloonist, I have found you at last. Well, I see you've been busy rescuing dragons, Spyro. You may travel to the Peacekeeper's world if you like. Yeah, sure, let's go. I have nothing more to accomplish here. And we are coming in for a landing. There we are. Ah, we've got 
horns and drums. Bit of a different theme to this one. Hello, Titan. How are you doing? Welcome to Peacekeeper, Spyro. Look how our treasure has been turned against us and stolen. Recover our treasure, Spyro. Collect treasure. Got it. Collect treasure. I can do that. And yes, I, I believe the treasure has actually been turned into these goblins, which is why they all they all drop it. And uh, these ones are like dressed up as little Napoleonic soldiers. It's kind of cute, actually. Uh, oh, they, they have cannons. They have cannons. No, none of that. I will not let you destroy me mercilessly with a cannon. Uh, but there is there is more money to be found, I guess, and these two are just having a grand old time. I almost don't want to disturb them, but I have to. It is a shame, but that's the way things are. Get out of here. Now, we pick up a few more bits of treasure. I'm not going to enter any of the levels this time, but I think we can get a good idea of the area anyway in this episode still, and collect all the gems if possible. I think I can actually, like, I can, yes, I can use the cannons. Ah, the power is mine. Now, uh, what, what do I have to destroy? There are things I need to destroy. I don't remember what they are or where they are. Uh, but they are around here somewhere. Uh, oh, hey, look, you've got a whole camp of enemy soldiers. No. Uh, Cliff Town. Oh, and, and they, they run and hide into their little tents, which I can scorch, and they moon me. Nudity. None of this. Who do you think you are? Get out of my way. Who do you think you are, I ask? Taunting me in such a crude manner. The indignity of it all. Yeah, yeah, you too. Get out of here. I will take away your huts before you even have a chance to use them. Well, I tried, anyway. Yeah, 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 you put that away. What else we got going on? There's a little tower there. Uh, oh, no, 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 no! I will not let you. Can I destroy the towers? Is that why they're here? Uh, oh, no, but I can destroy that. Ah, okay. Okay, so the cannons are here, uh, if I can line it up properly. The cannons are here to destroy those. I, I'm, I'm way off, aren't I? Yeah. Uh, maybe this isn't... Oh! Hmm, this one can't hit that. But if we line it up and fire... I think we can destroy that one. Yeah, there we go. That's how it's done. And, uh, oh, nobody home in that one. Oh, you are there, and you're just afraid. You're not even going to bother mooning me. Magnus. Hi, Spyro! Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job protecting you. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. Indeed, good job, Sparks. Uh, actually, you're, uh, yeah, you're not in the best of shape right now. You could use a couple butterflies, or at least one. And what's down here? Ice Cavern. Sounds ominous. Not looking forward to that one. Mind you, this is Spyro the Dragon, so, uh, it's probably still a very pleasant level. At least to exist in. I don't know if there are ice physics or not, but uh, here we've got water. Oh, and there's the there's the next balloonist. Good to know where that is. Uh, collect a, another life. Excellent. Burn down another tent. Good. Uh, you, little jackrabbit. Turn into a butterfly, pretty please. Now, uh, where am I going? Uh, oh, there's stuff. There is stuff, for sure. Uh, can I go this way? No, hmm, the, the purple goop is probably not good to be swimming in, so perhaps I shall avoid it. How do I destroy this one? Is there another cannon somewhere? There's gotta be. Oh, I can, oh, I, I can definitely just jump this, right? Like, this is, this is no problem. Okay. Uh, let's break a few of these treasure chests. See, now they're just dropping fives all over the place. Much more money here, it would seem, than in the previous world. Oh, hello. Got more of these. And hop. How do I destroy that? How do I destroy that? 
Is there even another cannon? I don't see any. Hello? Anything? Anything at all? No? Huh. Very odd. Oh, there's, there's a bunch of stuff there. What the heck? How do I get there? How do I get there? I can... Oh... Uh, I don't know. Can I jump down? Is this... Is this a dumb thing to even try? Oh. Well, I didn't try, but it looks like I'm going down anyway. Bye, Spyro. Nice knowing ya. Okay. Ah, everything's back to the way it was. I have to destroy all of their architecture again. How do I... How do I get this? Can I actually get it with this cannon? It seems to fire too far, but maybe it fires closer. Ah, I was overthinking things. It was much easier than I had thought. Uh, which means, ah, getting into there is probably also much easier than I thought. Uh, you see, in my haste, I did not notice that there was a target on this rock. And I can destroy it, probably. Line it up and fire. Boom! Yeah, destruction! Wonderful. And maybe now I can access this place, right? Perhaps. Uh, but there are more gems, too. Just lying on... Okay. I, I am losing most of my lives right here. You know what? Doing the levels, fighting enemies, easy. Traversing the purple goop, not so much. That is the true enemy of this game, the purple goop. All right. Was it worth it, Spyro, for six treasure? The answer is yes. Uh, what have we over here? There. Oh, lucky here. We've got another thief. A thief. No, get out. I guess that's egg number three. Uh, oh, and there's a, there's a key here. There's a key. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll take it. That's cool. And I'll rescue another dragon, Gunnar. Well done, Spyro! Keep up the good work and I know you'll fulfill your destiny! Destiny? I just want to kick some- Just toast those enemies and collect the treasure! Yeah, Spyro, just torch those enemies. Easy, and collect the treasure, but avoid the purple goop at all costs. Uh, where, where was that place? Right there, okay. I imagine that is... Uh, avoid the purple goop, I said! I warned you, Spyro! I warned you about the goop! Oh well. Four lives? Plenty. I have four chances to make it to, to this simple area in the overworld. The hub world <laughs> should not be so difficult, and yet it is. Okay, you. Out of my way. I am collecting more gems. I thought this was where the, uh, where the locked chest might be, but, hmm, doesn't look like it. Okay. Though I do think that's the boss, right? Uh, I, I can't read it. Night Flight. Ooh, it is not the boss. But that, I am quite positive, is one of those strange other levels that I was talking about earlier. Yes, they are all flight ep uh, episodes or levels. Can I get there? Can I get there? Mm, yep, there we go. Easy, nothing to it. Uh, ooh, treasure room. Yes, money, money, money. Surely this is the last of it. Money, 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 money. And this one, and one more. And that is 200 out of 200. Okay, we have made it. Can I leave? Is it possible to actually get out of here safely? Uh, it, it might be. I might be able to do it. Please, pretty please. Ah, yes, thank you. I have not lost yet another life to the goop. However, that will bring us to the end of this episode. So, we have thoroughly explored the Peacekeeper's world. So, next time it is time to actually start uh, going into these levels and collecting more gems and rescuing more dragons, just like the other dragon told us to do. So, I do hope that you enjoyed this episode, and if you did, then please leave a like, 
a comment, subscribe, and I hope that you'll join me again next time for the next exciting episode of this. Till then, ta-ta.